Hey y'all, are y'all struggling with the decision of when to cut off contact with someone who's causing you pain or distress? In just one minute, I'll help you identify the right time to implement the powerful no contact strategy. Number one, end of respect. If the person continuously disrespects your boundaries, feelings, or well-being, it's a sign that it might be time to cut off contact. Number two, emotional turmoil. When interacting with this person consistently leads to emotional turmoil, anxiety, or sadness, it's crucial to consider your own emotional and mental health. Toxicity. If the relationship is consistently toxic, harmful, or one-sided, and efforts to resolve the issues have not been fruitful, it's time to prioritize your own well-being. Number four, manipulation or abuse. If you're experiencing manipulation, emotional abuse, or any other form of harm, prioritize your safety and mental health by cutting off contact immediately. Number five, unreciprocated efforts. When you're putting in all the effort to maintain the relationship and it's not being reciprocated, it may be time to step back. Remember, no contact isn't a decision to be taken lightly but it can be a powerful tool for self-preservation and healing. Trust your instincts and prioritize your own well-being and mental health above all else. Cutting off contact is about protecting yourself, setting boundaries, and creating spaces for your own growth and healing. Your well-being matters, and you have the right to take control of your life and happiness. You've got this. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye!